good morning everybody i have got another weekly asda food haul for you so let me show you what i've got for this week so first off we've got some french fries because we've run out of them for the kids then i've got some chip shop fish from young's and there's four fillets in there they're really nice actually and the girls enjoy those so i mostly do this with a jacket potato for the girls um this one i got a six six crispy chickens and i thought these would do i don't know one of these with some new potatoes for the girls um, and they could have these in a wrap or something because they enjoy a wrap usual red milk i managed to get it this week um, then on to chilled meats i've got two lots of the thigh fillets that i always get so i think we're going to do the creamy chicken again i've got the cheese you know the philadelphia light in the fridge um we had it last week and it was so so tasty we just added some crushed garlic into it it's really nice excuse that one moment kids are home as you can hear anyway let's continue and then we'll do sticky chicken with rice for another meal then here we've got a big pork joint i didn't realize it was going to come through quite so big martin wanted me to do the slimming world pulled pork which i'm going to do but i think i could most probably cut this joint in half do half for a roast dinner half for pulled pork so that's what i'm going to do with that we got some more heck sausages sorry had to stop again had to deal with sophie um the last shop we had the heck spring chicken sausages i think they weren't they've got a little kick to them they've got chili in them so this one is the chicken italia i don't know what the, i think we've had these before but i couldn't tell you what they taste like it was so long ago so that will do we didn't have the toad in the hole last week so maybe we'll do that with these this week then i've got two lots of prawns i thought they were the king prawns that i had last week but they're not they're just like the little ones but still they could go in a jacket potato so when the girls have jacket potato with the fish me and martin can have jacket potato with the prawns and i i make my own sauce with um, mayonnaise and ketchup and it's really really nice so that's it for raw meats kind of thing then on to cooked meats i've got two lots of these chicken tikka chickens really nice in a sandwich or on the side of the girls cold dinners and i put these in a sandwich with a bit of um spinach like raw spinach really really nice then under here under the cheeses i've got some cooked ham for the girls um and then i got these little cathedral city so instead of buying um i'm gonna focus just wants to focus on my fat thumb um instead of the cheese strings i bought these to go and have at lunch this week they were a pound for those Sorry, this video is so stop and start. The kids are just arguing in the other room and you don't want to hear that. Then I got the mature white cheddar. So this is a big block, 825 grams and it's only 365 or something. I have still got a bit of cheese in the fridge, but I thought I'd best pick one up as we are running low. Showed you the ham tonight. Then I got some smoothies. Sometimes I treat the girls to like the ones in the cartons. But they're way more expensive, so I thought I'd do it this way. I can't remember what I paid for these, actually. But I got a mango and passion fruit. But I thought I can just put that into a cup for them when they're having breakfast in the morning. So you've got mango and passion fruit and pineapple, coconut and banana. I really like the sound of that one. Then I got two of these. One for Martin, one for myself. Martin's just gone to work, so he's taken his. But it's the Tropicana Viva Vitality one. So got that, just for a little boost. Then on to squash, I got orange and mango. We've got uh, apple and black currant in the cupboard, so I like to switch it up a bit so they're not having the same all the time. Then on to vegetables, got two tins of sweet corn because um, this is one veg. I say it every time, this is one veg I know I can get into the girls, so got some more of that. Got some tender stem broccoli, two lots of that. I've got some sweet potatoes, so I'm going to put sweet potatoes with the pulled pork. Yes, Bumble. Okay. Hello, go and dance with sisters. Uh, then we've got some spinach, cucumber, avocados. I like avocado, Martin doesn't, but he said he will give it a go as we're trying to eat a little healthier. So that's to go with something. Don't touch that, baby, mummy's videoing. Um, new potatoes, because we used all of those last week. If this video makes it up, <laughs> you'll be lucky, because I've had to stop again. 
new potatoes. Martin does these, so we boil them so they're soft and then put them in a pan and spray fry light over them until they go crispy and they're really, really nice. Then I got some courgettes. Ava loves courgettes and so do I, so that's that. That's everything for vegetables. I still got some mushrooms in the um, fridge, tomatoes and peppers for like salad. And I'm gonna do salad with this. I did buy an iceberg last week, but I put it with the spinach instead and it was lovely. Then onto fruit, I got some kiwis, some apples, the three for a pound watermelon fans, some pineapple fingers, some strawberries, and two lots of raspberries. Yogurts. These were meant to be the Muller yogurts that are like this, but they substituted them for these. So usually me and Martin like to have a Muller like chocolate pot with um, like a skinny crunch bar or something. Uh, but instead I said we can still have this but just not have the bar and it work out the same amount of calories so I did keep those and then I got these for Livy's pat lunch just some little fromage frays onto bread I got wraps because um, Livy will need those for nursery and for their cold dinners two lots of the seeded bread I bought the mini one again because it's less calories to eat the smaller slices of bread so and I love the seeded batch from Warburton's so nice and I got two because one wasn't enough last week and I haven't bought white bread the girls can just eat this can you hear the singing now they're, they're getting on now um yeah so the girls I'm just going to give the girls the same as us I did get some Warburton's thins I did buy the white ones this was the substitute they're half and half but the I've said this ages ago, the wholemeal ones of these and the white ones are exactly the same calories in it. So that's why I got the white ones because I thought the girls would eat those as well. Then I got two lots of pan au chocolat for breakfast for the girls. Three lots of these uh, crepes. They've already had some this morning for breakfast so that's why they're open. These have gone up massively. They used to be a pound a pack, 145 a pack now. Other breakfast bits I got were some go ahead fruit slices oh they're not high in calories either so me and martin could eat those as well and some strawberry bars as i call them like what are they called nutri grain bars but the asda version then on to crisps i've got some skips cheetos two lots of roysters um biscuits this week i got were these mini bns strawberry ones and these these are lovely top gems love those um, some sweetener I needed because that goes in my pulled pork recipe. Some mustard powder because that goes in my uh, pulled pork recipe. I've got passata, Worcester sauce and balsamic vinegar. They're the other things that go in the um, barbecue sauce basically. And the last thing was the two lots of toilet roll, two for six pound. And that is everything for this week. So... Let me tell you the total. It wasn't as much as last week. It came to £96.28. Only two substitutes this week. So we did well. Let me recap on meals. So the girls will have fat fish with a jacket potato. And we'll have it with prawns. A jacket potato with prawns. Creamy chicken. Sticky chicken with rice. Pulled pork and a roast dinner. And... I haven't got roast dinner vegetables, mind. I'd have to go up and get that. And something with the sausages. Either toad in the hole or we'll do an all-day breakfast again. So I've still got bacon from last week. And I think that is everything. So I'm going to put this away. And I'll catch you in our next video. Thank you for watching.